All right, welcome Winters fans. I'm Bob Millett, Senior Manager of Fan Experience, and today we are going to take a tour through our control room. So we have uh, one of the most top of the line control rooms you can have in all of minor league baseball, and I'm just going to go through with you and my uh, video production assistant, uh, Chance Fernandez. We're going to show you the things that we can actually do and the abilities that we have for baseball games and non-baseball events. So very first thing we have here, we have kind of your typical OES ISC 9000. This is what is going to input the score on the video board. And it's also going to input the score on our IPTV. So well, I'll talk about IPTV in a second, but basically it's our ability to broadcast the games in-house for every home game. So right next to it is our motion rocket technology here. So this is all the visuals that you're going to see on the video board. So uh, we're actually working right now on the WSU versus University of Houston game uh, line score. So as uh, Chance goes through that, he can kind of change that into a bunch of different kind of looks. So right now the score is up, but if he wanted to overlay a graphic over the entire scoreboard, he could do just that. If he wanted to do a two-thirds look, he can adjust it to that. If he wanted to do a full video, he can always adjust it as well. And then he can always do a wide screen center stripe and all those types of things as well. But for the most part, we'll be using center video and uh, two thirds video for most of our stuff. So as we move on, you can see some things that are probably a little bit more familiar. We obviously have our soundboard here. Our soundboard has a bunch of different mixes, up to 12 mixes. Mix one has a lot of presets. Obviously it's turned off right now. Mix two has some re presets as well. And this kind of just determines who's functioning this during the game. So for instance, we're gonna go and put it on mix one. The master volume's up. And we're gonna go ahead and just put this PA mic up there and we're gonna go ahead and just give her a test. And as you can see, that's how the PA mic is controlled. So moving on from there, if you've ever been to an event, you have to have music. And this is our computer that does that. This is our click effects computer. As you look through all that, you can see a bunch of things that are on there from you know run the bases chant music to home pitch to rock in-game type stuff and we can just click on these and they would play music throughout the ballpark now the volume is turned down right now because we're working uh, but we would be able to do that as well uh, another feature that's really great about this is that we can actually control all these functions from one computer so we have a good little short key here and i can change it to chance's computer right now if I want to go ahead and control the ribbons, I just come here, the short key again, the ribbon board, which are the boards that you would see on the side of the ballpark that have the lines towards another ad, I can change all that stuff here. If I wanted to go right back to music, I can just go there too. So we can operate with six to 10 people in one event, but we can also operate with two if we really need it. So the next portion of this video control room tour is our video production side. So we really have two sides. We have the in-game show, which we kind of talked about a little bit, and then we're gonna have the TV production. So hopefully if you come to a game this season, you'll get to see that all our games will be produced on TV, just like you would watch a normal game on television or a sporting event. We have our Ross Expression Machines right here uh, that do a lot of the overlays. As you can see, uh, we're working on some templates and things that we might be able to do for our TV broadcasts um, and some of our IP TV broadcasts as well. We have two of those machines. This machine currently is holding the score. So as I told you earlier with the um, OES board, uh, we were able to take that information, plug it into here, and then it would get changed over onto the IP TV. So if I wanted to click on this and change this out to that, which it is, take this, change it out, I can do that. And if I hit take, then it turns around and it updates it onto our IP TV board. And the last thing you guys have probably seen before in all types of sporting events is this is where all our cameras are. We are gonna run a five camera operation. We have four static and we'll have one wireless. And this person here is really kind of the conductor of the entire show. They're gonna be the ones that are going to determine what fan cam shots we get, what kind of video board graphics will go onto our TV broadcast, and they'll be kind of really doing it all. So um, that's really a quick tour 
of the control room. The control room is really probably the most vital uh, thing that you're gonna have at any ballpark because this is where all the fun comes from. So thank you so much and tune in next week for another uh, sneak peek of what's going on at Riverfront Stadium.